loves just me right now. Um, so, welcome back to the vlog channel. I'm actually starting Wednesday's vlog right now and it feels really weird because it's Saturday. But I'm about to go in and get my nails done. I have to actually run to the grocery store first and use the bathroom because your girl is about to like pee all over myself. Um, I am going in specifically looking for one color. If they don't have it, that's fine. I'm going to get something else because I'm here. But I'm looking for OPI CIA color is awesome. You guys, I saw that on someone this weekend and I was like, I need that. It's like a dark turquoise, but it was, she was dressed like very professionally and it was still a very perfect color. Like it was very professional and it wasn't just like, oh, she's got turquoise nails. So that's what I'm going to go in and look for right now. And I'm getting a pedicure because my toes are disgusting. My feet are disgusting. So that's a quick little update. I'll show you guys, I guess, what they look like when I get out. Um, oh, that girl has purple hair. I love colorful hair. I love colorful hair. If I wasn't a redhead, like if I was a blonde, oh my God, every month I would have a different hair color. All right, guys. So yeah, just wanted to update you, tell you what we're doing today. Besides that, it's like nothing. All righty. So God, my rosacea is so bad today. Um, how long was I in there? 10. Oh, I was in there over an hour. So I got a full pedicure because my toe or my ankles were super, super swollen from flying. And I think also not like, um, drinking a lot of water this past week. So I got the same color on my toes as I did my nails. I got my nails like kind of a raunchy, obnoxious color and I'm living for it. I wanted something different than like what I've, what I usually do. And I got, I wrote it down. So the color I was trying to get was OPI CIA color is awesome. This is basically the equivalent. This is from, it's called the color Veronica, which is 184 in the Envy dipping powder. I did take a picture so that I would remember, but I like it. I think it's so cool. It's so different from what I usually do. Um, I did get fake nails because I didn't have any length, but next time I go, they'll be like grown out. So then I'll get them to take the nails off and then either get them to paint them or I'll do it myself or whatever, but got the same color on my toes as I did my nails and I love it. Yeah, like so different from what I usually do. So I'm going home now and I'm not doing anything else today. I'm spending time with my husband because I miss him so much, so much. Okay, so let's head, let's head home. Lord, Lord, I'm vlogging by the way, babe. He's talking to one of his friends. Oh, no, he texted me. Say hello. What's up? I don't, I don't know why he does the peace sign with you guys. He hasn't done the peace yeah, sign heard, the entire five years we've started. been together. Also, something he hasn't done the entire five years we've been together is they've told Tita. Until the last week, I left for Wisconsin, and all of a sudden, he's, like, broken now. So, hold on one second. I have to hang this up. It's still wet. We really don't have a good place to like hang stuff that needs to dry in our house, so I'm just gonna put it there. So I just finished filming a video. Sam has helped me so much today with blog photos, which is why he's playing video games now. Like he is so over it. Look at this. Look at this. Just so these are my lights. Then I've got my regular camera. This is what I use for my monitor. Saley took 0.2 seconds to take my seat. Um, I filmed my October favorites video, and so that's where I keep, like, there's a bunch of stuff in there, but that's where I keep all of that. And it's just like, I move everything so I can have a cute background. It's just, it's mayhem, Sashi, isn't it? It's crazy. <laughs> Okay, so I have to go um, in, wow, I have my watch on. Oh, God, about two hours already. This day is going by fast. Um, I have to go pick my mom and my dad, well, Sam and I are going to pick up my mom and my dad from the airport. They were in Sarasota, Florida this week, I think. They went on vacation um, one last time for the year. And we drove them and have been like watching their dogs and stuff. So I'm gonna go in two hours and pick them up, but I also have to go to their house 
because my mother gave me strict instructions. She said, can you run the vacuum every other day, which is the youthy. I wouldn't even have to do anything. And I was like, yeah, sure, I can run the vacuum every other day. I went to Wisconsin, so Sam was in charge of taking care of the dogs, and I forgot to tell him, so our house hasn't been vacuumed in a week. So I gotta go at three o'clock and vacuum her house, because I told her I would, even though I did not, and I keep my word. So, yeah, just wanted to update you guys. Kind of catching up, playing catch up still here after traveling to Wisconsin this past week. It was just cold, but fun. A lot, a lot of a lot of work. We had like 12, 14 hour days every day, but it was good. So yeah, we're just kind of playing catch up today. Done a lot of laundry. That's why the bed is stripped. Um, yeah, that's kind of it. I'm really boring right now. Literally, bones are so spongy at that age that yeah they're going to be trying to heal quickly but yeah they don't want it to start like healing unaligned or not properly so you guys my lashes have like really started to fall out i think i think i've pulled a lot of them out not noticing because i'm finding them all over the place i don't i never realized how much i mess with my eyes until i have these things and then i'm like mid pulling them out i'm like oh shoot so I love them, but I don't know if I'm gonna be able to keep these long term if I don't stop messing with them. There's still a lot there though. Um, so I was just talking to Sam. His little brother broke his collarbone. God bless. Um, how many bones have you broken? Yeah. And then he's had a decent amount of surgeries, even in his uh, mouth, on his ankle. Having surgery is like kind of a major thing, though. You had your tonsils I've removed. Only, I've only technically had like two like surgeries. Yeah, I had my tonsils and adenoids removed when I was little, and then the ankle. Okay. And then the, the dental implant doesn't. I mean, it does. But I've had so many surgeries. They don't, they don't knock you out for it. You're conscious for all of it, so I don't. They did crack my jaw to do it, which sucked. You're conscious when? Uh, mm -hmm. nope, nope. Anyway, so, but Sam was just one of those kids who broke things, who ripped things open, who needed stitches, who dislocated stuff, and he came in last night and I was on the treadmill. The treadmill. Is that where you eat? Treadmill. What? Treadmill? Tread? Treadmill. Treadmill. I was on the treadmill. Tread. Yeah. yeah. Now you're just trying too hard. <laughs> I was working out and he came in and he was like, guess what? My brother broke his collarbone. I was like, oh my gosh. I said, your mother must have just thought to herself, God, I have already done this once. <laughs> Why am I doing it again? I mean, so we find out tomorrow if he needs yeah. to have surgery. But little cutie is left-handed and it's his left collarbone, so it'll be interesting to see well, how. Well, he's, he's actually he's ambidextrous, so it's not... Like, he can write with both hands. Can he? Yeah, he can write, he can, like, throw, he can... Go Avery, I know you watch these vlogs. You rock, little kid. He, can... he says he's better with one hand or the other, but half the time, if you don't, like... If he's not paying attention, he will literally pick up a pen or pencil and just start writing, and, like, it doesn't matter what hand it's in. Well, good for him. That's hard. That's really hard. I tried when I was little. It's. I think it's a little bit neater in mm -hmm. his left hand, but, like, he doesn't, like... It's not, like, a conscious thing, like, when you're an adult, you're like, oh have to use my right hand yeah I, like he'll, he'll literally just like the paper's on this side so i'm just gonna put it in this hand and just, yeah. he just starts and like he'll throw a ball with both hands and stuff so i tried when i was a little right with my left hand but i couldn't figure out the wrist thing because you know you see left-handed people write differently like they'll write with their wrist either broken or they'll turn the paper they'll turn the paper that's always the two i've seen either they turn the paper or their wrist looks like this when they write and my mom taught my sister when we were homeschooled not to do that. So I could never do it, but I tried. It's hard. Um, so right-handed is the way to go. So yeah, I just thought, poor. He's fine. Your, your poor mama. No, your poor mama. She's fine. He's a kid. Kids get hurt. He's fine. But she probably was just like, oh my God, I've done this already. He's fine. Oh, well, that little spitfire is gonna be fine. So my mommy and daddy are home. They got back, we went to dinner, 
and went down to their house and hung out for a little while. And I cried. I miss my mama so much. I cried. I was like, you're not allowed to ever leave me again. <laughs> Even though I was gone last week. Like, so they left last Sunday. I left Tuesday. I got back Friday. They came back today. So like, I mean, we were basically gone the exact same week, all week. But I just was like, you can't ever leave me again, mom. Like, good shit. Connected. So. Get up, get on. They're the home. <laughs> I don't know the rest of that song. <laughs> I don't think, I think this is going to be kind of an odd week. I have to go to Atlanta on Tuesday for work. But it's only, like, I have to be there where I'm going at 1130 and then I'm done at 2. So I won't be there, like, overnight or anything. I would scream if I already had to go somewhere overnight. So it's going to kind of be an odd week. But like I told you guys, we're getting back. Did you just pull away from me? All right, we gotta go fight. <laughs> Bye. And we completely forgot to finish this vlog out, so it has just been the craziest week. We're still trying to get back into the swing of things. Thanks, guys, so much for watching. We love you so much. Please subscribe if you're new here, and we hope that we see you in our next vlog.